Welcome everyone. Welcome to today's book reading. This is Paul Fletcher and very happy to be connecting with you today. We are into, we're still in chapter two actually, uh, we're on about page 240, something like that. And this is of course in the Tao One book, The Way of All Life, and that's by Dr. and Master Jigong Sha. And as one of his certified master teachers and healers, I'm very honored to, to be the one that is bringing this book to you. Um, I'm, I'm pushing the play button and letting Master Shah do the reading. That's a whole lot easier than me reading his words, and I am 100% confident they carry quite a bit more frequency and vibration than my words do. <clears throat> and then I also click the button on the Kindle book so you can read the book at the same time. So right now we're about halfway through um, the series, and... Uh, this, what, what Master Shah is doing, for those that have just stumbled across this, go back to my Facebook Wellspring of Light page or my YouTube channel uh, under the same name, and you can locate um, the playlist if you missed any of these. So Master Shah is, in essence, he's, he's giving us the, the uh, template for enlightenment. And there is a process by which that occurs. And so in this book, he's spelling out the process step by step. Uh, and right now he's in the middle of talking about different forms of soul healing. He's already talked about soul, soul, um, putting your soul language a little bit earlier, Zhen Guang Dao Ti, Bai Bing Xiao Chu, uh, that Zhen Guang is uh, growing your light body to heal all sickness. So all of these are relevant in a stepping stone pattern. And at the end of this, uh, it becomes an actual song. There is a song that you can search called the, the Dao Jing. Uh, I don't think he has the in front of it. It's called Dao Jing. And you can type in Dr. Master Shah Dao Jing, and you'll actually hear uh, all of the sacred phrases that he takes each sacred uh, phrase and then expands upon it. And so that's where we're at today. We're picking up where we left off yesterday. <clears throat> this is audio book number 12, uh, chapter 12. And it's the physical chapter number two in the book itself. So welcome to everybody who's joined. Great to see you here, Maureen, everyone else. Thank you for coming. And as always, thank you for sharing. So let's go ahead and share screen. And then uh, you can go ahead and catch up. Now we're going to be starting at what's called Soul Dance. He just... Uh, finished an uh, entire section on soul song and the importance of soul song. Now we're moving into soul dance. Okay. Let me make sure audio and everything is ready. And here we go. Soul dance. What is the soul dance? Soul dance is a soul guided dance. Why do people need to do soul dance. To soul dance is to boost energy, stamina, vitality, and immunity. To soul dance is to self-heal and heal others, including remotely. To soul dance is to transform your relationships. To soul dance is to transform your finances. To soul dance is to purify your soul, heart, mind, and body. To soul dance is to enlighten your soul, heart, mind, and body. To soul dance <coughs> is to serve humanity by offering love, forgiveness, compassion, and light through your soul dance. To soul dance is to serve Mother Earth by offering love, forgiveness, compassion, and light through your soul dance. To soul dance is to serve all universes by offering love, forgiveness, compassion, and light through your soul dance. How does soul dance work? How does one bring out his or her soul dance? Soul dance works because soul dance carries soul frequency and vibration, which can <coughs> transform the frequency and the vibration of your body, systems, organs, cells, cell units, DNA, RNA, smallest matter inside the cells and the spaces between the cells. 
So dance carries love, which melts all blockages and transforms all life. So dance carries forgiveness, which brings inner joy and inner peace. So dance carries compassion, which boosts energy, stamina, vitality, and immunity. So dance carries light, which heals, prevents sickness, rejuvenates, prolongs life. And transforms every aspect of life, including relationships and finances, as well as enlightens one's soul, heart, mind, and body. So, dance is an unconditional <coughs> universal servant to bring love, peace, and harmony to humanity, Mother Earth, and all universes. Now, let me teach you how to bring out your soul dance. Apply the full power techniques. Body power. Stand with your legs shoulder width apart. Put the tip of your tongue as close as you can to the roof of your mouth without touching. Bend your knees slightly. So power. Say hello, dear so man body of myself. I love you, honor you, and appreciate you. You have the power to bring out. My soul dance. Do a good job. Thank you, dear my beloved soul. Please get my legs, arms, and body to do soul dance by following soul music. Do a good job. I am extremely grateful. Thank you. Listen to the soul song, to soul dance music, to a soul symphony, or. To any appropriate spiritual music, mind power. Visualize a golden light shining in your entire body, from head to toe, skin to bone. Sound the power. Sing or chant the divine soul song. Happy, happy, happy. <coughs> Listen to me. Say now. Hey ya 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 yo i. Hey ya 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 yo i. Hey ya 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 yo i. Hey ya yo i. Hey ya yo i. Happy 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 happy. Happy 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 happy. Happy, 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 happy. 快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快乐，快。乐，快乐。Body power. Do soul dance for five minutes to a half hour or more. The longer you practice, the more benefits you could receive. The divine has guided me to create a soul song and a soul dance movement on Mother Earth. We have hundreds of soul song and soul dance healers, soul song singers, and soul dancers worldwide. The divine has further <coughs> guided me to create soul song and soul dance concert, workshops, retreat, and a certification training program for soul song and soul dance healers worldwide. Why are soul song and soul dance so special? Because they carry divine frequency and vibration, with divine love, forgiveness, compassion, and light. Soul song and soul dance are divine treasures for humanity to transform all life, including relationship, finances, and every aspect of life. The most important values in humans' life are to be healthy and happy. Soul song and soul dance can bring health 
and happiness to humanity, Mother Earth, and all universes. Chanting, chanting, chanting. <coughs> Divine chanting is healing. Chanting, chanting, chanting. Divine the chanting is rejuvenating. Singing, singing, singing. Divine the singing is transforming. Singing, singing, singing. Divine singing is enlightening. Humanity is waiting for divine chanting. All souls are waiting for divine singing. Divine chanting removes all blockages. Divine singing brings inner joy. Divine is chanting and singing. Humanity and all souls are nourishing. Humanity and all souls are chanting and singing. World, love, peace, and harmony are coming. World, love, peace, and harmony are coming. World, love, peace, and harmony are coming. Chanting, chanting, chanting. Divine chanting is healing. Chanting, chanting, chanting. Divine chanting is rejuvenating. Singing, singing, singing. Divine singing is transforming. Singing, singing, singing. Divine singing is enlightening. Humanity is waiting for <coughs> divine chanting. All souls are waiting for divine singing. Divine chanting removes all blockages. Divine singing brings inner joy. Divine is chanting and singing. Humanity and all souls are nourishing. Humanity and all souls are chanting and singing. World, love, peace, and harmony are coming. World, love, peace, and harmony are coming. World, love, peace, and harmony are coming. Apply. Soul dance can be applied to boost energy, heal, prevent sickness, rejuvenate your soul, heart, mind, and body, and transform every aspect of life, including relationships and finances, as well as enlighten your soul, heart, mind, and body. Therefore, I will give a few examples of applying soul dance. We will use the four power techniques. You can adapt the wisdom and the formula in these examples to transform every aspect of your life through your soul dance. Apply soul dance to self-heal. Body power. Stand with your legs shoulder width apart. Put the tip of your tongue as close as you can to the roof of your mouth without touching. Bend your knees slightly. Soul power. Say hello. Dear soul mind body of my soul dance, I love you, honor you, and appreciate you. Dear my soul, I love you, honor you, and appreciate you. Please guide my soul dance to heal my, make your request. Do a good job. I am very grateful. Thank you. <coughs> mind power. Visualize a golden light shining in the area for which you requested healing. Body power, do so dance. Generally speaking, do so dance for three to five minutes per time for healing. Pause this recording to practice now. The longer and the more often you do so dance, the better. For chronic or life-threatening conditions, so dance 
for at least two hours. You can do slow dance several times throughout the day for a total of two hours or more. Apply slow dance to rejuvenate your soul, heart, mind, and body. Body power. Stand with your legs shoulder width apart. Put the tip of your tongue as close as you can to the roof of your mouth without touching. Bend your knees slightly. Soul power. Say hello. Dear soul mind and body of my soul dance, I love you, honor you, and appreciate you. Dear my soul, I love you, honor you, and appreciate you. Please guide my soul dance to rejuvenate my soul, heart, mind, and body. Do a good job. I am very grateful. Thank you. Mind power. Visualize golden light shining in your entire body from head to toe, skin to bone. Body power. Do so dance now. Do so dance for three to five minutes per time for rejuvenation. Pause this recording to practice now. The longer and the more often you do so dance, the better. For chronic and life threatening conditions, so dance at least two hours per day. You can do so dance several times throughout the day for a total of two hours or more. So song and the soul dance are practical divine treasures for humanity to transform their health, relationships, finances, and every aspect of life. They are practical, simple to learn, and powerful. Practice so song and so dance more and more to benefit every aspect of your life. Ling Chiao Da So Typing Ling means so. Chiao Da means typing. Ling Chiao Da means so typing. Everybody understands typing. When a baby is crying, the mother gently pats and taps the baby and says, Baby, I love you. Calm down. If a child falls down and is crying, the mother holds the child, taps gently, and says, Everything will be fine. Think about it, this kind of tapping by a mother to her baby or child. You can understand that the mother is giving love to the child. <coughs> Soul tapping is not ordinary tapping. Soul tapping includes tapping the soul as well as tapping the body. Soul tapping is divine wisdom and a practical technique that the divine and Tao asked me to share with humanity. This profound wisdom and technique are so simple. Now I'm going to explain the what why, how, and the application of soul tapping. What? There are two kinds of soul tapping. The first is soul self tapping, tapping your own soul and the body to boost energy and self heal. The second is soul tapping of others to offer them remote healing. Why? Why should one learn soul tapping? Soul tapping can heal the soul very quickly with divine love, forgiveness, compassion, and light. Heal the soul first, then healing of mind and the body will follow. How? How do you do soul tapping? With the four power techniques. Body power, sit with your back free and clear. Or better, stand with your legs shoulder width apart. Put the tip of your tongue as close as you can to the roof of your mouth without touching. If you are sitting, keep your feet flat on the floor. If you are standing, bend your knees slightly. Make a fist with each hand. Put your right fist on the messy center. Put your left fist on your snow mountain area, on your lower back. 
slightly above tailbone. Soul power, say hello. There are so many body of my message center and the snow mountain area. I love you. You have the power to heal my. Make your request now. Do a good job. I am very grateful. Thank you. Mind power. Visualize golden light shining in the organ or area for which you requested healing. Body power. Use your fists to tap your messy center and your snow mountain area simultaneously. Sound the power. Chant repeatedly, silently, or aloud. So tapping heals me. 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 Tap for at least three to five minutes per time. The longer you tap, and the more often you tap, the better. Pause this recording to practice further now. One area you are tapping in this practice is the message center. The message center is the soul healing center, the emotional center, the love. Forgiveness, compassion, and light center, the karma center, the soul communication center, the life transformation center, and the soul enlightenment center. The messy center has incredible power beyond comprehension. For soul healing, the messy center is absolutely vital. The messy center is near the heart. Tapping the message center absolutely strengthens the functions of the heart. The heart is in charge of blood circulation. The heart is vital for healing and for every aspect of life. The heart is the key for intelligence because the heart houses the mind and soul. Therefore, if you have a brain issue, healing the heart is vital. This is ancient wisdom. Of traditional Chinese medicine, many people think <coughs> that intelligence comes from the brain, which is correct from the viewpoint of modern science. But they may not realize to increase intelligence, the heart is the key. In traditional Chinese medicine, intelligence comes from the heart. There are several different intelligences. Intelligence of the mind, intelligence of the heart, and the intelligence of the soul. Generally speaking, people have not had a great awareness of the intelligence of the heart. People have very little awareness for the intelligence of the soul. In the future, I will write a book about developing all of one's intelligences, including the intelligence of the soul, heart. Mind and body. The other area you are tapping in this practice is the snow mountain area. The snow mountain area is one of the two key fundamental centers for energy, stamina, vitality, and immunity. The snow mountain area is also the key for rejuvenation and longevity. To tap on the snow mountain area is to strengthen your kidneys. Because the kidneys produce jing, the essence of matter for the whole body, the kidneys are vital for health, energy, rejuvenation, and longevity. A human's life can be divided into physical life and the soul life. Physical life is limited. A person who can live to be one hundred years old. Is considered to be very blessed. How many people can live to be two hundred years old? And in history, there are few, very rare people who lived beyond the age of two hundred. My Tao lineage founder Peng Zhu, the teacher of Lao Tzu, lived to the age of eight hundred eighty. In Peng Zhu lineage, that I'm very honored to hold. There have been several masters who lived for two hundred, 
to 400 years. The founder of Taiji lived for about 450 years. The sacred Tao writings describe one Tao master who lived for more than 1500 years. A sacred Buddhist book describes a one Buddhist father who lived for more than 1200 years. I know that is very difficult to believe. Is it really possible to live to such ages? When you have a highly developed spiritual channels and become a true channel to communicate with the divine, you can ask the divine to explain almost anything to you. I was flowing in this book in the Love Peace Harmony Center in Boulder, Colorado. I was with about 60 of my top teachers and healers. They were listening to my flow and watching my assistant type my flow. At that moment, I communicate with the divine. I asked, Dear divine, for the masters whom I just discussed and who are recorded, as living long, long lives, 800, 1200, even 1500 years. Is this really possible? <coughs> I'm honored to hear from you. Then I ask one of my worldwide representatives, Marilyn Smith, to flow the answer to my question directly from the divine. This was Marilyn's flow. I am the divine. My most beloved, it is absolutely possible for a human being to live to these ages. This will be extremely difficult for many to believe. The way that most people on Mother Earth live their lives at this time makes it impossible for them to reach these ages. However, there have been people throughout the history of Mother Earth who have lived very extraordinary lives. They have done practices that have put them in great alignment with me, my frequency and vibration, my love, forgiveness, compassion, light, and so much more. They have lived their lives as unconditional universal servants. All of this made it possible for them to transform. That process of transformation brought about changes on the physical level that made it possible for them to reach very old age. So my response is, yes, it is possible. However, those who reach very old age, such as the ones you referred to, must live lives of complete commitment. They must live lives of alignment with me. They must do practices, and this must become their way of life. There will be no separation between their daily life and their life of practice. All becomes one, and all becomes aligned with me. We become one. This is how some have reached what seem to be unbelievable ages. Thank you for this question and for this opportunity to give this teaching to my beloved sons and daughters worldwide. I am your loving divine. Thank you, Marilyn, for your direct soul communication with the divine. Direct soul communication is to hear directly from the divine and flow out the divine words. This is one of the soul communication techniques I have taught to my students worldwide. Next, I ask Dao a question. Dear beloved Dao, is it possible for a person to live to be hundreds of years old or more than 1,000 years old? How can it happen? I ask another one of my worldwide representatives, Francisco Quintero to do a direct soul communication with Tao 
to answer my question. I have trained Mary <coughs> and Francisco and thousands of my students worldwide. Now I have more than 10 worldwide representatives. I have about 500 master teachers and healers worldwide. My top teachers are pure soul communication channels. I have trained them well. They can communicate directly with the divine and Tao. They can hear their teachings or see their images very clearly. That's okay. Hard to find a halfway point here because they're about ready to go into that flow. So we'll save that for next time. Uh, we'll come back in and we'll get to hear Francisco's flow from the divine as uh, to longevity. Okay. So uh, tomorrow, Wednesday, there's an advanced class I have to be at. Uh, same with Friday, actually. Friday is for Dao Hands healers. You probably, if you're a Dao Hands healer, you would have gotten that email. Uh, Thursday, uh, I will be dedicating it to my own podcast, the Wellspring of Light podcast. Um, I'm in the middle of series number three, and this is podcast number three. So I'm doing it on um, the nature of mind and mind blockages, Tao healing for mind and mind related blockages. Um, so Thursdays, so keep an eye out on the postings. Of course, I will post it as I always do in the same places. And you're welcome to join me for my podcast on Thursday at 12 noon this time. Um, basically a half hour earlier than when you arrived today. So thank you everybody for coming and hopefully I'll see you on Thursday. Bye-bye.